ourselves a little bit of a mix here. Some entertainment right up my alley. Walking Dead and that. We also have a Star Wars big box. We'll start with the free gift, the only sports portion of our break right here. Prestige, little mystery box thing here. Harrison and McGarry rookies and Bill Sharman and then an Adrian Payne. All right, we're gonna go the big box next, just because it's big. It takes up the most of room. All right, we do have a group break of this one up. It's the Star Wars Galactic Edition Series Three. All right, so you get a patch. Little Yoda action right there. And then your pop. Director Orson Krennic. And your comic. Star Wars 97. Seven point oh grade Joe Duffy story. Captain America on the backs from nineteen eighty five. And we got your graded figure. It's nineteen seventy eight R five D four with an eighty five grade. Yeah, I think that's gonna be our best angle. There we go. And your card is a George Rurek as commander. Right there. This is from 2016 Rogue One. It's a PSA 8. And it's number 23 of 50. There you go. Okay. And now, all right, so Road to Alexandria. We'll do that last. That's the newest one. Then we have some Cryptozoic. That's season four, part two, and season four, part one. All right, let's see what happens. I have opened a lot of this personally. Haven't done any Road to Alexander. I think might have done a blaster of that. But and a lot of these cards. Let's see what autograph you can get here. It's a great price on this. Really nice uh, autograph list, actually, for both part one and part two. So let's see what we can do here. There is, there's like a, a black parallel. It's not numbered. It literally, The Walking Dead is like elevated just a little bit. There are some uh, harder to get parallels as well. Let's see if we get you one of them. Beth, Carl, so young. All right, here's your auto. Greg Nicotaro, co-executive producer. Good get if you're going to round out all your autographs possible, like we're trying to do. That's what 
my wife and I trying to get an autograph of everybody on the show. Now, usually there is a relic as well, but there could be more than one. I've seen a few boxes with two relics in it. In theory, you get another autograph. I guess it's not out of the realm of possibility with Cryptozoic. There's Daryl and the governor. It's part of the little puzzle set. That group played the governor said he would be open to doing like a little prequel action, like a little mini series action on the governor. It'd be interesting to see if they do anything like that. I know they're trying to do more. And then you have a Terminus Resident. And that's the T. Actually, this set, uh, this is 10.1. It actually spells out Terminus finally completed my uh, set of this part of season four. All right, so we got both your hits. So the question is, is there anything else in the box? You should get a base set as well. Not sure if you've opened a lot of Walking Dead or not, but usually you get a whole base set in a box. Carol. Uh, no, not today. I believe there's still 28 spots left in it. Um, I did add, though, I added uh, any team that doesn't get a hit in the helmet break will go in another random for a Joe Montana signed jersey. Try to spice it up a little bit, but I just added that this morning. But I'm hoping as that uh, spreads around, that'll help get that one sold out. So, yeah, it's for the football helmet. Figured add a little something to it. And a, another relic here. You got a Terminus Resident relic. Two colors on that one, and that's M12. Yes, yeah, so all of our group breaks have to sell out for uh, for them to break live. All right, so you got a bonus relic, which, I, like I said, happens quite often, at least in the Walking Dead boxes. Uh, no, actually, I'm gonna move. We'll move it today, and it'll be up on our website, so you can check the new time and date. Uh, it'll be next week. We'll move it to. So that's one of these uh, Chrome Premium parallels I was talking about. It's a puzzle card Z6. When I'm done with this personal break, I'll move it. <laughs> no, sorry about that. We'll get it. We'll get it moved. Like I said, hopefully that Joe Montana will, uh, will help move it along. We'll see what happens, though. Uh, once I'm done with this personal break, I'll switch the time on it. I had to take a look at the schedule and see when it'll fit the best. Alright, last pack. Not a bad start. Extra bonus. Relic. Like I said, the premium parallels don't um, aren't guaranteed or anything like that. Alright, here we go. Season 2. And really, as it stands right now, the uh, Cryptozoic Walking Dead is the only spot you can get your Andrew Lincoln autos. You can get to sign uh, with Tops. Well, there are a lot of uh, people that sign with Tops that didn't with Cryptozoic just because the nature of 
the new actors and the seasons and whatnot. But, oh, this is cool. There you go. Authentic prop, little wine bottle. Action right there. That is one I do not have. 35, M35 wine bottle prop. First pack, nice, nice way to start. Another relic coming up here. Another thick one. It's a Terminus. It's got uh, like three colors going on right there. Terminus resident. But again, nice thick piece. And that's an M43. So hopefully, I don't know. Like I said, I don't know if these are your first boxes that you have bought of this. If not, hopefully we're getting you a couple of hits that you don't have. waiting for the auto let's see I don't know how much let's see how much suspense we can build up before we pull it man Eugene what a character arc he's had I won't do any spoilers but uh... oh it's your first boxes oh well there you go yeah I don't know how many I've probably opened boxes of this not sure no, i mean i know there's people that have opened more but oh no there you go this is a great hit how about a glenn auto perfect excellent didn't want to jinx us or anything like that but awesome it's a great get to get that is one we do not have we were fortunate enough i did we did get a uh we did get an andrew lincoln auto out of this in one of the boxes but uh, Glenn definitely is a... Oh, here we go. See? All right. You can tell the difference right there. These are out of 99. Yep. 26 and 99. All right. Good job. Good stuff there. You got a chrome in your first box and then uh, out of 99 parallel in your second one. Like I said, this is different than the uh, sports boxes where parallels are, are prevalent. They're, they are few and far between in, in this. I would imagine there's nothing else in here, um, but you never know. Okay, so yeah, this must be the one. You can barely tell, but I'll leave these when you get your when you get the package. These two will be back to back. They're one of these is the parallel and one isn't, and they're super hard to tell, but such as life but you can you can feel it's it's weird but yeah that's one's the parallel one's the not one's not could have went with a different color would have made it a little bit easier to pick out actually you know what i'll put them oh well, that's funny yeah i'll put them i'll keep them together so you can take a look when you get home but like i said they're they're not easy to pull out Actually, would have been a lot easier if that's how they did it every time they put one in there. If they just doubled the cards up, it's much easier to tell. Couple more packs left in this one. All right, well, 
I think you did well. I think you should, I think you can you can be happy with your first two boxes. Definitely the second box. Hitting a main actor's auto like that. Like I said, it's a it's a small auto checklist which does increase your odds. Um, so now we're gonna go to the tops walking dead. And as you notice it says one auto guaranteed. Actually their first uh, set they put out, season five, um, did not guarantee an auto. You got two hits, but there were boxes that had, you know, like a printing plate and a relic. Um, so they quickly they quickly changed that and every set since then has guaranteed at least one auto. So this is pretty cool because we're going from seasons one through seven. So it's, like I said, it's got a, a pretty diverse checklist for Walking Dead, which is nice. They've gone back and they've, um, they've gotten autographs for our, um, like Shane and Lori Grimes. They, they're in it. Again, no Andrew Lincoln, um, but maybe, maybe at some point he will pop up. Now there are parallels in this, a little bit easier to see, like right there. I have a few varieties that are not, look at how young Carl is right there, some Woodbury stuff. Um, it's like rust and mud, I think, something like that. The numbered ones are Midnight Blue, Mold, Black and White, Blood Red are the one of ones so they have a couple of non-numbered parallels as well. Like I said, it's kind of cool. It's season one action. So yeah, I think those might be the same. I feel like one's mud, one's rust on those. Young Carl. And why, why is that? Is there a reason? On the road again. Hope going way back right there. Insert. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Gotcha. like a parallel on one corner and not on the other. Here's your parallel. A whole new world. A little Jesus action. So have you done any other Walking Dead boxes besides this or is this just your first for all of them? Inside job and then Walker Hall of Fame. Which kind of cool insert. There you go. Ooh, this this will be interestingly numbered. There's a Daryl Dixon relic. There you go. Two a twenty-five. Very nice. First for all. Well, it's a great. That's a you're ahead of the game on your relic. Obviously, you're getting Daryl, and it's out of twenty-five. So that is very good. Now it's an autograph. Maybe we get you like a numbered parallel too. Sorry, that was a insert. Negotiations parallel. Oh, okay. Yeah, like I said, I did a booster, but I did a, a blaster of this as well. Victory and loss. Another Walker Hall of Fame.
Merrill action. Falling off the wagon, and your auto is of Andy. Jeremy Palco is Andy. No numbering on this one. We do have the bounty for the 25 of 25 auto. That is still alive. Negan action. Going back for Merle. What had to be done. I'm trying to think. Hold on, I'm getting you a rundown. I'll let you know. He was a food exchanger for Hilltop. He was part of the Hilltop. He, de he uh, delivered supplies to the Saviors from the Hilltop. Welcome to the Kingdom. I was I had a look because I was gonna say he was a part of Alexandria, but he he's not. I get him mixed up with uh, oh great, and I can't remember his name either. Exterminating Terminus and Negan, Deanna's son. I get them confused. They don't look anything alike, but for whatever reason, whenever I see Andy, that's who I think it is. The wall comes tumbling down. Hilltop right there. Gregory. That's a throwback shot right there. Another interrogation. Lori Grimes. All right, here we go. Some uh, extra bonus for you. How about a cool sketch card? A Walker sketch card. Awesome. So you got three hits in your box right there. Um, Jason. Pretty sure it's Jason Miller is the artist. He did great, man. So very nice box. Feel it offsets. You know, you got you got a really good relic piece. Auto, okay. But then the sketch cards, a nice little added bonus. Even the box out a little bit for you on that. Final confrontation. Merle. All right. No, well, that's wrong. I thought we were I thought we were done and over with the hits. I was proved wrong. Wolf attack. <laughs> oh, really? We got so there's pack hunters, then we got a midnight blue of Jadis, and that's a 40 of 50, and then a Walker Hall of Fame. 
All right, solid stuff here. Relic, auto, sketch, and numbered parallel. Pretty much checked off. The only thing you're just missing is a printing plate. Promise to keep in touch parallel, Maggie. Carol, all the old pudding, eating, eating pudding on a rooftop during the zombie apocalypse. The threat of Negan. Sanctuary. There's Abraham. Some of the best lines in the show came from Abraham. Find us and then the wolves. Alright. There we go. Hopefully you enjoyed that. Very nice. The Glen Auto is huge. And then that last box was nice with the extra stuff in there. That's from Walking Dead. Yeah, there's a, <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of things I, I can't necessarily repeat them myself, um, but maybe maybe another day I can have some quotes by Abraham later at night. But uh, um. Yeah, that you should actually if you they have a video they have a game, a mobile game and that's one of his that's like his quote unquote the power up that he has that he gives the party, but anyways. Stories for other days. Stories for other days. Uh we'll be around if anyone else wants to put a personal break in. It looks like the only group break that's gonna sell out or that will sell out is our um triple play baseball, which already sold out. But uh we'll be around for more personals. We'll talk to you all soon.